Greetings, Cunningham family. I am Ms. Shante Morris, the proud principal of this outstanding school. Currently, our building is closed due to COVID-19, but we are still here to serve you. It is unclear when we will be able to welcome you in person with open arms, but our lines of communication are still open. All Cunningham teachers and staff are here on campus practicing social distancing and preparing for a different but yet another successful school year. We promise to be open to love, diversity, hope, hard work, and new challenges. Typically, during our traditional back to school orientation, you are able to meet your teachers and learn what the school year would be all about. Well, although we are online, you will still be able to see the smiles of your awesome teachers and hear about the wonderful things you will learn and get to explore this school year. After this video is over, go to the Cunningham Middle School website and look for the CMS Back to School Quick Links to see your teachers, practice logging in to Class Link, Google Classroom, and Skyward. Students, when you log into Class Link, you will see all of the programs that you will need to be familiar with to have a successful school year. Keep in mind, students, you will be accounted for every day using Class Link. So go ahead and get into the habit of logging into your Class Link account today. When you are in Class Link, look for Skyward. That is where you will see who your teachers are and also the place where you and your parents will keep up with your grades. Once you have logged into Skyward to view your schedule and know the names of your teachers, visit their websites and there will be a welcome video for each teacher and other important things that you need to know to make this year successful and smooth. While you're in Class Link, get familiar with Google Classroom and Google Meets. This is where your teachers will upload lessons and meet you virtually each day. Whew. I know that was a lot for you to remember. That's why this video will be available for everyone to view again, and we'll also have all these directions in our quick links on our website. To keep up with the latest Cunningham news, make sure you are following us on all social media sites. We're on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and we now have this awesome new YouTube channel. Parents, I also encourage you to join my Remind Group text. Visit our website for instruction. Again, if you missed any of this, be sure to visit our website and all social media accounts to stay in the loop. Students and parents, remember, our building is currently closed, but we are open to you. Welcome to Cunningham Middle School, and I look forward to meeting you all face to face. But in the meantime, Stay safe and healthy, and I will see your smiling faces online on the first day of school, which is Tuesday, September the 8th. See you soon. Hello Wildcats, my name is Ms. Boston and I am this year's 8th grade school counselor. Welcome to a school with an awesome team spirit. I look forward to taking times to just enjoy the little things in life and I hope you will too.
and I would like to welcome back all returning Wildcats and welcome our new Wildcats. My name is Dr. A. Glenn and I teach 8th grade College and Career Readiness, better known as CCR. I am also the team lead for the Bengals. I cannot wait to meet you. Cunningham is a home of champions and a place where we are family. Our doors may be temporarily closed, but we are open to you, our parents and students. Hi, I am Ms. T. Johnson, eighth grade science teacher and Cougar team leader. One of the things that I love about Cunningham Middle School is the caring and supportive atmosphere. A positive affirmation I'd like to leave you with is that I, or we, have the power to make our dreams come true. Hello, my name is Miss Smith, and I am the ELAR Pre-AP teacher for eighth grade. I am on the Cheetahs team, and what I love most about Cunningham Middle School is that Cunningham Middle School accepts you for who you are. And our positive affirmation for this upcoming year is going to be, I choose what I become. Hello students, my name is Miss DeGrasse and I'm the team lead for the Glorious Golden Tigers. One thing I love about Cunningham is our family culture here and how we're all in this together. So kids, this year is going to be a little different than the rest, so please remember, a negative mind never gives you a positive outlook. Strickland. I am a seventh grade reading and writing teacher at Cunningham Middle School. I am also the team lead for the Jaguars this year. One thing I love about Cunningham Middle School is that it's family oriented and because it's family oriented we as a staff are very close and I love that about this school. Hello students, my name is Mrs. Broussard and I will be your teacher for Think Tank and I am also your fabulous team leader for the Dynamic Lions team here at Cunningham Middle School. One of the many things that I love about Cunningham is that we are all about family. We have a family culture and I love that about my campus and my district. A positive affirmation that I would like for all of us to have and to adapt to is that Together, we are stronger. So no matter what may come our way, students, we will conquer this together. I look forward to working with each and every one of you. Bye. Hi, 
My name is Miss Rose and I am the team leader of the Panthers team here at Cunningham Middle School. One of the things that I love about Cunningham Middle School is that this is a campus made up of teachers who care about student success. And every one of the teachers here will go above and beyond to make sure that their students succeed. One of the things that I always tell my students is, good, better, best, never let it rest until your good is better and your better is your best. And I cannot wait to help you achieve your best this year at Cunningham Middle School. See you soon. Hello, my name is Mrs. Bright Pickram. I teach principles of human services. What I love most about Cunningham Middle School is its friendly and family-oriented atmosphere. Together, we are developing future leaders. one of the assistant principals here at Cunningham Middle School. During this orientation, I will take you through the first day of school procedures. Can you believe it? The first day of school is finally here. On September 8th, we will be in A day, periods one through four. On the second day of school, we will be in a B day, periods five through eight. And guess what? On the third day of school, we're gonna go right back to an A day, periods one through four. 
So students, remember these rotations because we will continue with the A and B rotations for the entire school year. And also remember that on September 8th, this is the first day of school. And this is also an A day, periods one through four. Let's get started. So the first thing I need for you to do is log into our Cunningham Middle School webpage. It looks just like the one that you see on the screen. The next thing you will do is click on students. Once you click on students, a new page will open. I need for you to scroll down and go to class links. Class link is where all of our district apps are located. This is also the location where you will find three of the most important apps you will use throughout the entire school year. The first app that I want to show you is Skyward. Click on Skyward. In Skyward is where you will find your grade book, your attendance, your schedule, and so much more. Now that you see where your teachers and your classes are located at, if you have any concerns about your child's schedule, visit our website or the Wildcat Word, our monthly newsletter, and complete the electronic schedule change request form by Tuesday, September 1st. Let's take a look at another app. The next app I want to show you is Google Classroom. Click on Google Classroom. Google Classroom is where you will be communicating with your teachers every day. Your teachers will post assignments, put graded work, and send videos and video links for you to view. This is also the location where you will upload all of your completed assignments. Let's click in one of the Google Meets classrooms. Notice that there is a unique code listed underneath the classroom title. This code is only for the students that are enrolled in this class. We are not allowed to share any Google Classroom codes with any students not enrolled in the classroom. Any students who choose to break the rule will receive a consequence. Again, Google Classroom codes are only to be used for students who are enrolled in that classroom. Each Google Classroom has its own unique code, so let's not share. Underneath the Google Classroom code is where you will find your Google Meets link. Clicking on the Google Meets will take you to view your teacher and your classmates. This is where you'll have actual interaction time and talk to your teachers and your classmates. Again, this is another unique link that cannot be shared with anyone not enrolled in this classroom. So remember, we will not share our Google Classroom codes and we will not share our Google Meets code. Now that we've had an opportunity to explore Google Classroom, let's take a final look and look at Google Drive. Click on Google Drive. Inside of Google Drive is where you are able to store your classroom assignments. Look with me on the left-hand side and click on New. This is where you will be able to create a new folder, upload information, create an uploaded folder, create a Google Doc, create Google Sheets, or create a PowerPoint. This is the location for creation. Your teachers may ask you to use some of these tools in your Google Drive. So it's best that you get used to using most of the tools that you've seen today in Google Drive, Google Classroom, and in Skyward. Wow, I've shared a lot of information with you. Remember, if you need to go back and look at this video, it will be posted on our YouTube page. You can also follow us on Facebook and Instagram. I wanna show you the last and final product, which is our virtual schedule. This is the schedule we will use until we go back face to face. On September 8th, you will log in at 1035. 
10.35 is the time you will log in every single day, Monday through Friday. The first class you will go to is your focus feature class. Remember, this is the class period that had a zero by it when we looked at Skyward. So make sure every day at 10.35, you will log into your focus feature class. Your focus feature teacher will give you more instructions about the rest of your day. Remember, on the first day of school, this will be an A day, periods one through four. On the second day of school, it will be a B day, periods five through eight. Remember, we're all in this together and we will get through this one day at a time. Thank you and I look forward to seeing each and every one of you this school year. Bye-bye.